to my channel yesterday i want to show you guys how i make the juice so watch this video till the end so that you don't miss don't miss any step my words keep on slipping man but let's start this video so what you will need is some sugar and you can either use dry rosellas these are dry rosellas right here you can hear like some oh they fell but these are dry rosellas can you see them they're like Red, burgundy, they look so beautiful. Anyways, we'll need dry rosellas or what is this other word they use? The opposite of dry. It's wet, but I don't mean to be like wet. You know what I mean? The the ones which are like oh dry rosellas or fresh, fresh rosellas. Also need water. Then we're going to pour. I'm using this much amount of uh, rosellas. I won't use a lot of water, but you can add more water if you have like a big amount of rosera so we're just going to pour this we're just going to let it boil actually i'm going to add more water because when the boiling starts the water will get a bit dried out you know it will evaporate so i want the juice so i'm going to add some water so that it can boil and get hot but you can add the sugar if you want at this stage but i usually don't add the sugar because I like it to add it later on. So we're just going to let it boil. And then we will be back, guys. It's starting to boil a bit. I just wanted to show you the color of it. And then it will get more um, dark red. And actually, the more you have these dry leaves, the more darker the red will get you can even make tea with this leaves but for this video it's going to be a recipe of juice in my next video it's going to be the tea recipe let's continue boiling it because now it's just that the water has just started getting hot so we're going to boil it for maybe like one hour or maybe 45 minutes. Okay guys, so it's, it's ready. You can see it here. See how red it is? So from here what I'm going to do is I'm going to filter out this I'm going to use this here and I'm going to use this one. Because I'm making a video I didn't want to wait till I till the the juice cools. If you can wait for it to cool, then filter it. That is also a good thing. Just to like be more safe. Then after this, I'm going to take the sugar. You can put as much sugar as you want. So after this, I'm just going to let it cool and then I will be back. I will be back to show you guys the next step. And I wanted to show you guys the color of the left um, rosaries. Okay guys, so we are back and now it's time to put the juice in a bottle, you know, because it does cool down and stuff like that.
If you watch my juice videos, you know this is my favorite part of this thing. I'm going to put some ice. Hey guys, our drink is ready. So guys, that's the end of our video. If you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to comment um, if you like the video. And yeah guys, I will see you on my next video. Bye.